everyone how are you so today we are going to do another fun activity that has been taken from your book mary code class 4 in cert from the form he avatar and to get to this activity you have to open your book and turn to page number 98 so let's see what do we have to do in this activity so this activity has also been taken from the section let's try it and we have already done the first two questions of that section so we will now move forward to third and fourth question so today we are going to deal with the third and fourth question that has been given in your book marigold class 4 ncert in the chapter hiyavata at the page number 98 so let us see what do we have to do in third question the third question is describe hiyavata his home and friends in 10 lines so we have read the poem and now we have to write about hiyavata what we have learned about hiyavata his home and about his friends in 10 lines so we have to write 10 lines describing all of these and the fourth question is what did hiyavata love so we have to tell what did hiyavata love what was he so fond of so before doing this question let us read the poem one second so that we could be thorough with the poem so let's start Hiyavata Hiyavata was a young red indian boy he lived with his old grandmother nokomis in a wigwam now we know who hiyavata was and where he lived nokomis taught hiyavata about the wonders around them she told him about the stars the trees the insects the birds the animals and many other things hiyavata grew up to love them all he could talk to the birds and animals and they to him so this was special about hiyavata that he loved every one of them he loved all the birds all the animals and he could talk to them so this was this paragraph from this paragraph we now know who, who was yavata and where he lived and what he loved now let us read the poem so that we can know about yavata more and all about his friends as well then the little yavata learned of every bird its language learned their names and all their secrets how they build their nests in summer where they hid themselves in winter talked with them whenever he met them called them hiyavatha's chicken of all bees he learned the language learned their names and all their secrets how the beavers built their lodges where the squirrels hid their corns how the reindeer strands so swiftly why the rabbit was so timid talked with them whenever he met them called them hiyavatha's brothers so now we know everything about hiyavatha how he was so fond of all the birds and animals that he gave them their own nicknames and what were all the secrets that they tell, that they used to tell to hiyavatha now we can do the question so let us start with the third question that is describe hiyavatha his home and it and friends in 10 lines So let's start. Hiyavatha was a young red Indian boy who lived with his old grandmother Nokomis in a wigwam. Wigwam is a type of house. Nokomis taught Hiyavatha about the wonders around them. He also learned to love birds and bees. He used to talk to them whenever he met them. Birds and bees also loved him and talked back to him. He learned their languages, their names and all their secrets. The birds told him about their hiding places and how they build their nests. The beavers told him how they build the lodges and the reindeer told him how they run so fast. He called the birds hiyavatha's chickens and beasts hiyavatha's brothers. So these 10 11 lines I tried to describe hiyavatha his home and friends. You can add more lines to it and you can change the paragraph altogether. Please try to do it try to do this activity on your own and tell me which lines did you add now let's move on to the fourth activity that is what did hiyavatha love so now we know that hiyavatha loved all the bees meaning all the animals and the birds so let us write it hiyavatha loved to learn the language of all the birds and animals and about the things around him such as the stars the trees the insects the birds the animals and many other things so if i can say this i would say that hiyavatha was a true nature's lover 
right he loved nature and everything that is present in it so yes he loved to learn the language and everything about all the animals present around him he was so kind so caring towards them that they also used to love hyakta so this was the third and the fourth question of let's write we'll meet next time with another fun activity poem or story until then bye bye